Welcome back to Kids Fun Science. My name's Ken. Today's experiment is oil bubbles in water. What you need for this experiment is a jar, oil, I use veggie oil, water, salt, and a spoon. Look in the description for more details. To set up this experiment, you're going to take a jar and fill it three quarters full of water and then add two cups of veggie oil or any kind of oil that you have. You're going to have to wait a couple minutes to let all the bubbles um, you know, dissipate and eventually you're going to come up with all your oil um, and water separated. Now we're ready to do the experiment. So we're just going to take regular table salt and you're going to pour it into a spoon. I have an extra large spoon here. It could be any size you want. We're going to do this multiple times. And then you take your salt and you're going to pour it into the jar. And there it goes. You start to see the oil bubbles popping up through the water. And I'm going to explain the science behind it. So the science behind this experiment is oil and water don't mix, no matter how hard you try. Oil is less dense than water. Because of oil and water are made unlike molecules, they cannot interact with each other and they stay separate. What happens with the science when I add the salt? Well, salt is heavier than water, so when you pour the salt into, onto the oil, it sinks to the bottom of the mixture, carrying the blob of oil with it. In the water, the salt starts to dissolve. As it dissolves, the salt releases the oil, which then floats back up to the top, and it continues to do that just like a lava lamp. So go ahead and try this experiment again, but next time use two different jars. Use one with warm water and one with just regular cold water, and see how the two different temperatures in the water affects the rate on which the salt dissolves, and how the bubbles either go slower or faster. Make sure you write down in the comments below and let me know how it works out. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, remember to click thumbs up and to subscribe. And thanks for watching.